By the eighth minute of injury time, Man United was still leading Chelsea, but Palmer's double in the last two minutes of the match brought a surprising 4-3 victory to the home team at Stamford Bridge. Man United and Chelsea created a reign of goals at Stamford Bridge, a match in round 31 of the Premier League. The two teams brought an emotional match to the audience, but the most outstanding thing was probably the poor defense of both sides, which was the main reason why the match had many goals. Chelsea started impressively, the home team had two goals in less than 20 minutes. However, Man United was able to equalize 2-2 before entering the break. In the middle of the second half, the away team scored the third goal, taking the lead 3-2. The match had nine minutes of extra time. By the eighth minute of extra time, Man United was still leading. However, Chelsea was awarded a penalty near the final moment and found a 3-3 equalizer in the 90-plus-10 minute. Surprise after surprise, Chelsea scored the fourth goal in the 90-plus-11 minute, thereby winning the final match with a score of 4-3. Coach Ten Hag suddenly left Rashford on the bench, he used Antony and Man UTD's starting lineup during their away trip to Chelsea. The away team played equally with the home team after the opening whistle. In the fourth minute, Man UTD's defense blocked the ball unsafely, creating an opportunity for Gallagher to shoot the ball at the top of the penalty area. The English midfielder's low shot beat Onana to help Chelsea open the match. When Man United could not make an impression in attack, they had to concede the second goal. In the 17th minute, Antony fouled Cucurella in the penalty area and the home team received a penalty kick. The foul showed the Brazilian midfielder's immaturity while dropping back to support the defense. On the 11M mark, Palmer successfully made a shot to increase the score to 2-0. to zero. Two goals conceded after just 19 minutes of play left Man United stunned. The away team was forced to push their attacking lineup higher, but for a long time they had no real opportunities in front of Petrovic's goal. In the 34th minute, Caicedo passed an error to Garnacho to steal the ball. The Argentine midfielder accelerated and defeated Petrovic in a face to face situation, the match score was shortened to 1 2. The goal boosted the morale of Man United players, the away team continued to attack and the negligence of Chelsea's defense quickly made the home team pay the price. In the 39th minute, Fernandez initiated a counterattack for Man United, then the Portuguese midfielder comfortably headed the goal from Dalit's cross, equalizing the score 2-2. Man UTD's defensive system is also very shaky. Minute 45 plus 4, Maguire, Case Miro, Varane lost the ball quite ungainly on their home field and they could not block Chelsea's attack. Luckily for the away team, the post assisted Onana in blocking Palmer's shot. Entering the second half, coach Ten Hag brought in Evans to replace Varane, the French midfielder who was injured in the first half. However, midway through the second half, Evans suffered an injury, forcing Ten Hag to replace young midfielder Camboala. After the first half of the second half there was no change in the score, Man United suddenly took a 3-2 lead in the 67th minute. From the home team's counterattack, Antony crossed the ball so that Garnacho dived down and headed the ball into the net. Another lost goal shows Chelsea's negligence in defense. It was clear that Garnacho was the only one capable of threatening Petrovic's goal, but the home team's defenders left it alone and did not follow the opposing striker. Being behind made Chelsea quite embarrassed. Indeed, coach Pochettino's team did not play impressively for a long time to come. It seemed like the Blues were going to lose at home when suddenly it happened in the 90 plus 8 minute. Dalit was overtaken by Majuake. The Portuguese player chased after him but lost momentum and fell into his opponent. Majuake immediately fell in the Man United penalty area and the referee gave Chelsea a penalty. D.A.R. also got involved, perhaps Majuik was acting, but clearly Dalit could not get away with it. On the penalty spot, Palmer continued to defeat Onana, helping Chelsea equalize the score at 3-3. Surprise after surprise, just one minute after finding a draw, Chelsea scored again. From a corner kick, Palmer kicked a shot from outside the penalty area, the ball hit McTominay's side and changed direction into the net. Palmer completed the hat-trick and Chelsea recorded a 4-3 victory. 
The loss to Chelsea makes Man United almost no longer able to compete for a place in the top four. Man United has 48 points, ranked 6th, Chelsea rose to 10th, with 43 points. Both teams still have the ability to compete for participation in the European Cup next season. For Man United it is the Europa League, for Chelsea it is the Europa Conference League.